first frequency summation surveys. First graph and economic One plus one divided by two. One. Frequency, mean. central tendency, and two. Inflationary. Mm. Organization and tabulation ng various. Math. Yung ba yung uh, 36, 24, 36? Numbers! Yeah. We have a lot of ideas about statistics, but what is the point of all these numbers? As statisticians, we believe that people are still missing out on the real essence of statistics. Statistics by the people. For the people. Through the people. I'll take it in, statistics but don't by the people. The Philippines actually has an efficient way of collecting and disseminating information, providing a rich source of reliable statistics used in analyzing the socio-economic conditions of the Philippines. The National Statistical Coordination Board serves as the coordinating agency of the Philippines and releases policies that ensures effective collection of data. Some agencies under the National Statistical Coordination Board are the National Statistics Office, which conducts census of population and housing, the Bureau of Agricultural Statistics, and the Bureau of Labor and Employment Statistics. All of these agencies collaborate in order to provide a more efficient and a more reliable statistics for the people. Statistics is for the people. Statistics plays an important role in people's daily lives. No matter who you are, no matter what field you're interested in, you always resort to decision-making to come up with results. This decision-making process is crucial because it affects the future events in the society. One of the fields that widely uses statistics is the government. Statistics provides figures that represent the pulse of the masses for better lawmaking. Proper use of these statistics will result to a better society, a better security system, a more comprehensive education system, more effective medical assistance, and so on. Statistics is through the people. How can statisticians do their jobs of analyzing and interpreting data if they do not have respondents? How can the government formulate laws and programs if they do not know what the people need? Think of it. We live in a world of reciprocity. We need you, and you need us. Imagine a government system that fully understands and knows the needs of its people. Wouldn't that be nice? Isn't that what every one of us wants and expects from the government? Yes, but that wouldn't be possible if we keep on ignoring and taking these surveys for granted. After all, all of us will benefit from these. So take a stand and spare a little of your time to answer these simple surveys. Give suggestions, voice out your opinions, and be heard. So statistics is not merely numbers and graphs. It has real-life applications that aim for a better society. First, statistics is by the people. Statisticians do their jobs to produce quality data that people can trust. Next, statistics is for the people because it applies to the different fields of knowledge as well as in the government. And lastly, statistics is through the people because without our respondents, we are nothing. We need to hear the voice of the masses to correctly represent them in our survey. Understanding of statistics and active participation of the masses, together, we can make a significant difference.